Can you repeat the question? Of course. What permits and inspections are needed before construction can start on a new home? So permitting depends on the area and the market that you're from. So our construction company works out of multiple markets, New York City, Massachusetts, Pennsylvania, Florida, Rhode Island, and each state has its own way of tackling permits. But there is a universal approach to it for the most part. When you're applying for a permit, there's a number of uh, pieces of documents and paperwork that you have to put together, and licensed individuals may be required at certain stages, depending on the scale of the project. So a permit will be required. Um, usually the United States in general goes by something called the International Code Council, um, which is basically a nonprofit quasi-governmental organization that establishes the building codes by region and area for the entire United States. And it's adopted by many states in the United States. In fact, maybe all of them. Um, but for the ones, for the states that I work in, the International Code Council or the ICC codes, which entails the International Residential Code and the International Building Code, are the set of codes that determine what requires a permit and what does not require a permit. Most major construction projects that involve altering the frame, the foundation, etc., will involve a permit. To apply for a permit, you're going to need some licensed individuals. You may need a licensed general contractor, and preferably insured as well and bonded, depending on the size of the project. And you're going to need a licensed engineer, structural engineer, maybe civil engineer, and architect, licensed architect. So depending on your project type, you will need to consult the building department of where you're from, where the project is located at least, and the individuals that may be appropriate for that project.